been a whirlwind of a week for Charger hockey. Supporters rallied and raised more than $750,000 to save the program. UAH President Darren Dawson honored his word, and hockey is back. Former UAH hockey players weren't going to stop till Charger hockey was back. We're hockey players. You know, there's a little bit of fight in all of us. Alumni rallied support, raising enough money for another season. Just to read some of the comments on the GoFundMe page, you know, I think it's sort of provides us with affirmation that, that we we really did have a positive impact on the community. Former Charger player and coach Howie McEckern says the next step is establishing an advisory board to help the university with the team. Because Huntsville is unique. It's a, the most diverse place I've ever lived, and we have a unique thing in UAH hockey. I think this is an exciting opportunity to get get the band back together, right, and um, and really have a have a positive impact on the program. Former UAH goalie Mike Zeller says Huntsville is better because of UAH hockey, but it's going to take a lot of support to get the Chargers back to the glory days. But hockey players never back down from a challenge. What we want is to build a program that UAH can be proud of, that the city of Huntsville can be proud of, and the entire state of Alabama can rally behind it. Dawson says the Chargers need a five-year philanthropic funding model and work out conference issues if they want to keep hockey beyond next season. Reporting for Way 31 News, I'm Lyndon Blake.